Hey guys, welcome back. Today we've got the second video of the Tips and Tricks series. And so we're up to Rocky Mountains, where I'll be using a 4 power club, even though I've got 5 power because I know that most of you use 4 power, and so that's going to help the most of you out. But yep, this is Tips and Tricks, so maybe it's little roots, maybe little shots, could be a specific starting spot, things like that. Anything to help you get the lowest amount of shots possible and win the most amount of games on Rocky Mountains. So let's jump straight into it, starting off with the first tip. So this is for the very left position, and what you want to do is max it with the tightest angle possible, so straight down there across the half pipe. And if it flicks you across here, then it makes life super simple because you can just bank it off that wood where that arrow is. And it brings you straight over to the platform and look how much of an easy hole in three that is. So the hard yellow line it up. And that is a super easy three from that particular position. So this next one works for all of the positions. First shot is just normal, maxing it out here. But the second shot, instead of tapping it over, you want to do like a hard orange and bank it off this angled piece of wood. You just got to be careful not to hit that sand pile, so make sure you aim it so you don't hit that. But then it brings you all the way down here. Look how much of an easier line that is for a hole in three increases the chances of getting a 3 significantly on that hole from all of the spots. So this is for all the positions on this side. You want to do a softish orange off that triangle so it brings you down right into this corner right here. And then from here you can just max it straight over the bump on the very left. And if you can get far enough with a little bit of accuracy, boom, look at that. You can get a hole in 2 from the right, start, or right spots as well as the left. So this one, first shot's just uh, normal. This also works for all of the starting positions. And the tip comes into play here. And instead of maxing it, you want to tap it up to that second square up at the top there. And then from here, you want to angle it straight over to the edge. From that line, it's a hard orange. But I'm a little bit behind, so I'll make it a soft red. And look how easy it is to just fall down nicely. Plenty of space, never going to stuff it up, and gives you an easy hole and fall with that four power club. So this next tip, from the first shot you want to try and land where that arrow is. So if you're on the left spots it's a soft orange, if you're on our spots then you got to do it a little bit harder. And then once you land here, you just got to max it straight over to the right, so it's tight as possible. And it brings you over into this little gap here, and then you want to try and max it straight off the very tip of that corner. But you got to make sure that the board, moving board, isn't in the way, so just keep an eye on it, wait till it's in a good position. And then you can just fire it off that tip, brings you across here. And then the last shot is a hard orange off that tip. And that is going to give you a hole in four. This works for all of these positions with the four power club and probably the best way to get a four with a four power. So this is for the two positions on the right side. You just want to max it out straight over there and land on that little plank of wood up the top. Just like that. And then the second shot, you got to go off the back wall because you don't have the angle. But it's super simple, just like a middle to hard yellow. Bank it off that back wall and look how easy of a hole in two that is. Boom. And then for the two left positions for the same hole, basically the same idea. You just want to max it out onto that plank of wood. Land it up here. And then this one, you just got to basically do like a hard yellow, middle yellow, and then tap it where that arrow is. Make sure the squares line up with the hole. And if all goes well, boom, easy hole in two from four out of the six starting spots. So I'm going to show you how to get a hole in three reasonably consistently with a four power even. First shot's just normal, and it's all about the second shot. You want to aim it, max it, but you've got to do it to the right side of the half pipe because you want to try and land up on this piece of wood right here. If you can land here, then it's an easy hole in three. You just max it out and it's always going to get far enough. So as long as you can get on that wood, it's a hole in three, even with the four power club. And the very last tip is the ferris wheel one. And this, you, from all spots, you just want to max it up onto that plank of wood in the middle there. This brings you up nicely like this. And then from here, you can do like a middle green, 
straight through that gap and boom into the hole. Look how easy that is for a hole in two with a four power club. Nice little tip there. And that does it for this tips and tricks video for Rocky Mountains. Hopefully something helped you out in there. If it did, make sure to like and subscribe. Otherwise, stay tuned for the future videos in this series. Snowy Valley will be up next. You guys seem to be liking it, which is great. I'm liking making it, helping you guys get your shots better. But otherwise, that's going to do it for this video today. Hopefully you enjoyed. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care. Peace.